Hey, what's going on, folks? I am your host, Rock D. Lee. Shout out to my homegirl, Kiki, who let me know that XG came up with a new song, Something Ain't Right, or at least they released a new song early this morning, and I got to it as soon as possible. Check out the Discord in the description of this video, guys. I do check messages, and of course, I do have an active Patreon. You can participate in polls and suggestions, and of course, check out the upper tiers for early access and uncut material. But let me not waste y'all time i know what y'all are here for and it's a music video reaction let's jump into it i do a run through check out the lyrics and depending on how it goes down i might circle back and revisit some of the lyrics and or my favorite parts let's go oh. <laughs> they do look crazy Wow. The fashion choices. What is happening? It's a real adult melody. With the swag. Look at you go, girl. Boy, put you in the spotlight. You can tell me what you want, but it's all right. Knock, knock, who's there? It's your whole life. I don't do three shacks only one time. One time? I wish you would. I wish you would. I gotta go back there. That's fire. That was fire. Transition. This is a fun video. <laughs> That's fine. I like that part. I just can't get over what they chose to wear. The fashion is something else. Fire. Oh, what do those eyes do? Let me go back. Let me go back. Let me go back. Wow. Wow. Now I got to go back to around 140. This is my favorite melody for sure. Oh, I got to go back even further. She killed it. Actually, I'm gonna go back. Right here, right here. Way she can. Test me, I wish you would. That's fire. That's fire. I'm gonna tell you why I like it, man. Yo, it's so thugged, man. And she said, I don't even want to lie because I have I have access to the freaking internet. So I'm going to go back. Now, the whole thing is fire. So obviously, my favorite part is literally right smack dad in the middle. And that is actually not unusual for me. I don't know what it is about bridges, transition. I'm not the best at explaining uh, musical construction. 
I uh, will pick up more on that as we do these uh, music reactions. I'm supposed to be a professional now. Anyways, I'm going to play it and I'll break down why I like it so much. It's first of all, swag and confidence. Look at what she's wearing and the in the dope delivery and the in, in the uh, I don't want to call it arrogance. It's just confidence. Hey, you can tell me what you want, but it's all lies. It's all lies. It's a whole life. Knock, knock. Oh, that's only two. All right, anyways, but knock, knock, it's your whole life. I don't do three strikes only one time. Oh, wow. And then the walk that she comes in, like, it comes in like a zombie. Like, even the way they chose to behave and or dress in this music video is just so entertaining. Anyways. Open book. Test me out. Wish you would. Ooh, I wish you would. I got to talk to you guys about that. And be crazy. The melody. Who the hell do you think you are? It's perfect. It's perfect. Hey. Get ready to dance. And girls, break it down over here. Some. I'm not even a fan of the low shave look. I ain't gonna hold you, Will. Leave me alone. I don't want no problems. I'm usually not a fan of it, but the way I don't have her name, but the way she's rocking it, it's like, it's turning me into a shaved head believer. I'm not gonna hold you. And there's a sharp contrast because I like the dark hair and the long hair over here. And then I go to shaves and I'm like, you know what? Shaved is in, that's fire. I, I'm, not, I'm not just saying that. I'm not just saying that. She's rocking that with confidence, like it. And I'm going back to the center, that's my favorite part. And I'll tell you about the wish later. Uh huh. Uh huh. The whole thing is fun. I wish you would. That's just too fun. That's like, who the heck do you think you guys are to be running games on me? I just, I just, like I said, I absolutely love the execution. So obviously, uh, someone's being fake. Homie's not acting right, and girls are calling them out. They know that something is not right. They know games are being played, and it kind of remind me of. I forgot the groups who's saying don't go chasing waterfall. It's, it's throwback, man. But the point is. Uh, in a different culture, it still reminds me of music that I grew up with that I'm used to. You know, I don't want no scrub, you know, those days. Uh, can't pay my bills, can't pay my telephone bills. This is kind of a group that got that energy, but it's, of course, them. It's 100% unique. I'm just telling you, like, like, how I connect to it, what makes me connect to it, and what my past memory is that makes me vibe to it. And then when she said, I wish you would, uh, if you guys ever watch Kings of Comedy, how you recommend it. Uh, Cedric the Entertainer had this line and I was like, black folks, we live by a different creed. It's the wish factor. You know, it's we, <laughs> I'm not going to say what the other race is, but they mentioned another race and it's like, the other race, uh, their factor is hope. And I, like, ah, I hope no one's sitting in my seat today and us, our creed is wish. So I was like, I wish we'll be sitting in our seat. Boy, I wish somebody would. Anyways. White people hope things don't go wrong. They have high hopes, and oh my God, we're running a little late. Oh my goodness, I hope no one's in our chairs. <laughs> Black people got a totally different creed we live by, it's more confrontational. Black people don't hope, we wish. We wish a mother would be an I. I'm not a comedian, so it's probably not funny listening to me, but again, I'm just sharing with you things that make me connect with the song. So, I thought it was fire. And I'm just gonna play it uh, one last time. I got nothing to say because I think it's definitely, definitely, definitely uh, a banger or something to add to my playlist. So I'm just gonna check it out. And if I'm talking, so be it. This is my last watch. That's recorded at least. Something ain't right, something ain't right obviously. Nope. There's such a fun video. And again, it's not like any of the videos I've seen. I keep seeing different variations of XG. I can't put them in a box, you know? Definitely can't.
Yeah, boy. This is so good. I like it. Figured you out. This walk. She's like having a breakdown. <laughs> Who thought of that? It's so fun. I'm going to stop talking. Stop. They're having so much fun. Go, girl. Uh huh. You guys know I feel about the center of the song. I wish you would. That's a perfect song. That's a perfect song. Yeah, so much, so much replay value. A lot of fun to listen to, a lot of fun to watch. So I, I like it, I like it. Wow, man, X2 is really uh, gathering up momentum uh, uh, on my preference list, so to speak, which they already are, like they already are. I really like XG. Um, you know, there's just something to it, just giving more authentic thoughts. Like when a group can start getting past five great songs like for me personally where i'm like i will add five of your songs to my playlist that's when i'm like now nah, i'm a fan of that group so i've lost count i think i think we're up to four <laughs> i think we're up to four that uh are on my list so they just they just need one more beggar they just need one more beggar i'm like all right all right all right, all right. i got i gotta add them in the upper echelon of groups because uh it's like you know, so many groups say they could do one hit song. They could do two hit songs. You know, I remember Cisco Thong song, Unleashed Dragon. That's it. That's all I got. But hey, we're all going to remember Cisco. Anyways, anyways, anyways. So when I get to the fifth song, I'm like, okay, okay. This is a group with longevity. And so far, guys, the momentum is there. The momentum is there. Uh, every XG song I've heard, I think I've just added to the playlist. So I like every XG song. I've just only heard for as of now. Doesn't mean I won't hear more. You guys are, you know, I'm circling through twice. I'm circling to XG. I go to Red Velvet. I go to BTS. I go to Stray Kids. And I like I try to save a lot of the videos for uh, my wife to watch with me so she can enjoy the journey. Um, but when it's a song like that just came out today, I usually won't hesitate on those because you guys know how YouTube and algorithms are. And it does a lot for the channel to hit them early. So XG, look out for them because, like I said, the work is fire. And I got to say that none of the songs are anything like each other so far. So I appreciate how much variety they have. You cannot put them in a box. The dancing, the outfits that they had was all fire. <coughs> you could tell, in my opinion, that they were really having fun dancing, just doing their thing. There was some girl on the right-hand side of one of these dances. 
I'll know her when I get to her. But like, oh yeah, we're there. We're there. Oh, it's her. It's someone. She. I think she gets all the way over here. But the point. Oh, it's right here. There's a girl on the right hand side. And I don't know what she was doing. She was doing random kicks or whatnot, just having the time of her life. And when I see personality in groups, that really uh, resonates more with me. And I like the concept. So anyways, I'm, a, I'm done talking because, you know, Lee, I could keep talking like forever. Yo, we got an active Discord. Check that out in the description of this video. I do appreciate tags for new releases on K-pop songs. So I don't miss out on any of the heat. Uh, we got an active Patreon. Um, you could join that for free. For free. For the suggestions and the polls, we do have the upper paid tiers for early access to uncut K-drama uh, K reactions. Obviously, we have the Your Boy Rock Lee reaction channel also in the description of this video. I'm out.